हेलो स्टूडेंट माय नेम इज़ गगनदीप एंड आई विल टीच यू कंप्यूटर आवर फर्स्ट चैप्टर इज कंप्यूटर हार्डवेयर कंपोनेंट्स सो लेट्स स्टडी कंप्यूटर्स आर मशीन्स दैट परफॉर्म स्पेसिफिक टास्क अकॉर्डिंग टू अ सेट ऑफ इंस्ट्रक्शन और प्रोग्राम एज वी ऑल नो कंप्यूटर इज अ मशीन तो कंप्यूटर्स आर मशीन्स दैट परफॉर्म स्पेसिफिक टास्क दैट वी विल गिव टू कंप्यूटर दैट स्पेसिफिक टास्क विल बी डन बाय आवर कंप्यूटर एंड इंस्ट्रक्शन और प्रोग्राम दैट विल इनपुट टू कंप्यूटर अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट कंप्यूटर विल प्रोवाइड अस आउटपुट अर्लियर कंप्यूटर वर यूज मोस्टली बाय साइंटिस्ट इंजीनियर्स फॉर कॉम्प्लेक्स कैलकुलेशन but nowadays we also use computer as our daily tool and they were very costly too at that time when engineer and scientists used computer the computer was the computer were very costly nowadays computer are within the reach of every working person like us human beings or any other person used in it company any other for official use for students nowadays everyone have computer so computer are within the reach of every working person it has virtually become a need in every sphere of life so we can say that computer will become our basic need so next topic is anatomy of computer a computer comprises of two major components the first component is hardware and the second one is software what is hardware the hardware the physical components of a computer hardware is the physical component of a computer which we can touch and feel as we know the desktop the keyboard the mouse are the hardware that we can touch that things are known as hardware hardware can be further categorized into internal and external hardwares hardware also classified into two categories internal and ex external hardwares now the second topic is software software is a set of programs what is software software is a set of program which controls the internal operations of computer and instruction of computer about the work to be done the work which have which the computer have to done that is done with the help of a software for example unix ms word etc software can be classified into two main categories first the system software and second is the application software the hardware and the software are interdependent to each other's functions without these two components a computer cannot work the hardware is dependent on software and software is dependent on hardware both help each other to do a particular task for example without the driver of a hardware and os kernel a program which directly interacts with the hardware we cannot use the hardware similarly without the processor and a memory it is impossible for a software to run now internal hardware the hardware components that are installed within the cpu cabinet are called internal hardware all the parts of uh, cpu in which uh, the hard disk and uh, many more things for example cpu ram rom disk driver hard disk drive blu-ray disk drive cd disk drive dvd drives motherboard network card sound card video card etc are the internal hardwares then motherboard second topic that uh, we will cover that is motherboard what is the use of motherboard in computer it is cover it is covered in internal hardware a motherboard is the main circuit board of a computer that holds the most essential component of the computer system 
द बेस ऑफ अ मदरबोर्ड कंसिस्ट ऑफ अ रिजिड प्लास्टिक शीट द बेस हैव अ प्लास्टिक शीट द बोर्ड इज द मदर and that board is called the mother of all components that is where it gets its name it serves as a single platform to connect all parts of the computer together and allow them to communicate with each other and it helps as a bridge to communicate with the other things of the computer other part, uh, parts of the computer the motherboard is mounted inside the cpu the motherboard is placed inside the cpu cabinet and connects cpu memory hard drives optical drives video card sound card and other expansion cards directly or via cables the motherboard works like a bus terminal and the motherboard works like a bus terminal where all the functions of computer is held or kept junction of all the device as all the buses originate from and end up to up in the terminal similarly all the activities related to the connected device starts and end up in the motherboard all the functions starts from the motherboard and at last end in the motherboard a motherboard mainly contains the processor chip bios battery memory chip external storage controllers of video display and sound expansion slots for connecting additional circuit boards then we will come on pci peripheral components interconnect pci serves as a connection between a computer's motherboard and any connected hardware the pci term transmits data and power between a computer and the device it transmit the data and power between the computer and the device the pci was introduced by intel in 1992 intel corporation is very well known corporation and the pci is introduced by intel in 1992 next thing is sound card a sound card is a hardware components that is fixed either in an extension or expansion slot or on the motherboard it is rather on the expansion slot or in inside the motherboard on the motherboard it controls the input and output of the sound signal it also controls the signals of, of the sound that is it receive and sends audio signals to and from the computer it also sends and receive the audio signals in the computer and sends to from the computer a sound card converts the digital data to sound and it converts digital data to sound and vice versa and also receives digital data and convert it to the sound it enables the computer to reproduce sound or play music through output device with the help of output device like speaker we also produce sounds like headphones and record audio with a microphone with the help of microphone separate pci sound card are used to get higher quality sound extra pci sound card we will use to get the higher quality sound now video card the video card is an expansion card that is used to generate the video output to a display screen video card is used to show the video on a display screen such as on monitor on tv or projector it is also known as a graphic card the video card also known as graphic card which we recently used on our computer for gaming purposes video card is used to enhance the quality of display images video card also uh, enhance or upgrade the quality of a display image this card contains its own processing and memory unit that card also have its own processing or memory unit it's not dependent on hardware of the computer hard disk of the computer and is connected to the motherboard via accelerated graphic port agp or pci peripheral component interconnect connections 
सो थैंक यू क्लास फॉर नाउ सी पी यू एंड अदर टॉपिक्स वी विल डिस्कस इन अदर क्लास थैंक यू इफ यू हैव एनी करी देन वी विल आस इन नेक्स्ट क्लास थैंक यू